Hi folks, this is Amy Posniak, and I will be your instructor this year for some FlexUp courses. I just wanted to touch base and give you a general outline of what you can expect in the Flex Lab and how we have it laid out to serve your purposes the best um, to our abilities. The Flex Lab is a great environment because it meets the best of both the online environment and the classroom environment, fitting it in in your flexible needs. So what that means is all the assignments will be in Blackboard, but there'll be dedicated times during the week where you can get to an instructor um, physically or via online or a phone call, an email, to answer any questions that you may have on your upcoming work. I have my Flex Lab laid out so the assignments are chunked um, into like quarters. Uh, the deadlines are not as rigid as uh, in some courses, but I also have guided uh, deadline dates or due dates to keep you on task to make the course um, doable within the time that you're doing it. So with that being said, I'm just going to kind of walk you through this real quickly and um, look forward to meeting you soon. All right, this is a welcome page here, and you'll, you can take a look at that on your own here in Blackboard. Course information is a place where you'll want to come and review some of the items. Your syllabi books and those types of things will be found here, as well as software needs. Uh, this is a great place to, to get some overall information and a good place to look before the um, school year begins. Like I said before, all of your assignments will have due dates, and what that means is when I have them here in the course assignments area, they will disappear after that date has passed. So we have a collaborate session here, and this is like a virtual Skype kind of way for you to connect with your instructors, and it looks like this right here. Um, begin the tour. I don't need a tour. Um, but it's very much like Skype, and you can turn on a microphone, we can record it, raise your hand, do what you want to do in there. Now to get to that, you will go to um, your course tools, and you can go right to collaborate, right here, and you will get it there. Now, we do have a mandatory orientation for you folks. And what that means is I just need you to check in. Um, I have some information that I want you to look at, um, but I'd like you to check in the first week. I have some times listed here. Again, if you're in the Superior area and you want to come and see me, that's fabulous. If you're not close, you can give me a call, an email. We can do a collaborate session. I'm very flexible. That's the name of the game. Um, I will give you some points just for doing that and making sure that we have everything all set for your FlexLab course. There is a FlexLab review as well, and you'll utilize the materials of your syllabus, um, some of the other general FlexLab handouts to answer those questions. All right. When you get into the course, you basically will stay in the course assignments area unless you're prompted to go to a supplementary software um, for some of the classes, and then that uh, information will be done there. But all of the grades will come back to Blackboard. I strive to get my correcting done within one week of the due date, um, and I try to in answer all my emails and calls within 24 to 48 hours during the business week. I do try to stay uh, in touch in the evenings and on the weekends because I know as a student myself, um, that's when I'm doing, that's when I did my work and um, that's when you need some answers. So I, I try to be as flexible as possible and uh, we'll do whatever I can um, to make this successful for you. When you go and look at some of those documents out there, there's one that's called the FlexLab Overview, and this is what we'll talk about on um, orientation night. But what I want to show you here are uh, the hours that were open, and um, myself is listed here along uh, with Barb Williams. She has hours in the FlexLab on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. That means if you're in my class, you can certainly go to Barb's Flex Lab hours, but I will be correcting your work. Um, same thing, Barb's students can come to my Flex Lab hours, but she will be correcting the work. We will help you. We're versed, uh, pretty knowledgeable in each other's classes, so um, we're here to, to help you. Um, and then we'll go through this list. One of the other items that I want you to take a look at would be your Student Flex Lab guidelines, and this has more specifics on the policies and procedures in the Flex Lab. Next is a book list, and I would encourage you 
to look at this as well. Um, this will tell you what you need. So if you're taking the Administrative Office Procedures course in the Flex Lab, you will need this book as well as the Office Suite. All of my classes are listed there. You will need to look at the section number to find out if it's a Flex Lab class or if it's my online class, you name it. Um, and it will have some information about the software and the textbooks you need. We have a wonderful bookstore at WITC, but there are many options for you to get textbooks today. Um, I encourage you to utilize all of your resources. You can rent textbooks. You can purchase them. Um, there's many, many different things that you can do, but it's your responsibility to make sure that you get the right textbook. Okay. If you have any questions on textbooks or software, please make certain that you, you contact me. Last but not least, I do want to show you what a typical assignment sheet will look like. Um, this is going to be for the Flux Lab here, and um, you can read that information if you're in doc formatting, but um, you'll see here that I have the big deadlines set in quarters. So uh, you have three pretty big chunked assignments here and they're all due on September 19th or on this due date. However, I've given you individual dates to keep you on track weekly to make this um, attainable and successful for you. These classes cannot be done in one week turnaround time. Um, so I encourage you to use your time wisely and make sure that uh, this is a good fit for you. Okay. So again, when you are working out in Blackboard, if you come here, you will see that there are due dates on these folders and there will be multiple folders in your courses. When the due dates hit, the folder will disappear. Okay. So again, very excited to work with you in the Flex Lab this semester. Um, and if you have any questions, feel free to call me. Enjoy the rest of summer. Take care.